Good morning, everybody, and welcome to Vlogmas Day One. Roll the intro. Vlogmas day one, and I am not home as you can clearly see. I am actually at the Monaco in Pittsburgh because I was just with my parents' um, ancestor for Thanksgiving. And you will notice that I'm by myself. No Steven, no Bubba's. The reason is leading up a couple days before we were supposed to leave, like Saturday and Sunday, and Monday and Tuesday, Bubba's was sick. And then Wednesday morning was very sick. So the vet recommended that we not travel with him. I really needed to see my sister and my parents. I haven't been home in a really long time. Um, so Stephen stayed home on Thanksgiving with the dog. And I came to Ohio. And now I'm in Pittsburgh to take a little bit off my drive. And I might also swing by Ikea this morning. But... Yeah, it's been a weird Thanksgiving, but Bubba's is doing better, Steven is doing well, and now it's Sunday, and I have work tomorrow, so I have to drive home on Vlogmas Day 1. It is not what I expected, um, but this is what we're going to do. And the sad thing is, today's Advent challenge is to spend time doing something like someone special in your life really enjoys, which I wanted to do like a huge hike with Steven because he really likes it. Um, but A, I'm not here, and B, I think I'm going to be driving into a winter storm on my way home. So it's going to be an interesting day one of Vlogmas, but I'm super, super excited to get this adventure started. My advent calendars are waiting for me when I get home, and we will make the most of day one. But I am so excited that you are all joining me and going to give some of your time, which is your most precious gift, um, this December to watching some of my videos. Um, that is a huge honor, one that I don't take lightly, and I hope, I hope that you get out of Vlogmas. Um, a spirit of kindness, feeling uplifted, feeling positive, and that this just brings another layer of light and joy to your holiday season. Um, because I know interactions with you and doing this always does that for me, even though it can get exhausting. Um, but I'm really excited. Um, Sunday's themes in Vlogmas are simple Sundays, so this is truly going to be a simple Sunday. It is going to be me driving probably singing um, in the car, but I am going to get ready to go. We will get settled in and then we will get this day rolling. Well, I am dressed and ready to go. I'm rocking this really cute hoodie I found at American Eagle that has like little ski people on it. Um, this North Face vest and then my hunter boots because it is so rainy and gross out. Um, I also downloaded the Casey Musgraves Christmas Show album to listen to in the car, and we're going to go see if the valet has pulled my car up. So, this hotel, if you're ever in Pittsburgh, Hotel Monaco, it's beautiful, it's super cute. I love it. I love it, I love it, I love it. When you come into the room, you have this closet here, and just look how cute the wallpaper is. And then to the left is the bathroom. This wallpaper is just insane. The mirror is so cute. The light fixtures are amazing. And then the shower is just like beautiful, beautiful marble. It's stunning. But the best part is this room. The light fixture, the mirror. Then there's like this huge credenza here with like all this detail painting. Um, Oh, this is the wet bar. I have a key to this somewhere. Oh, it's over on the desk. And then this chest of drawers. Then there's this little desk. And then look at the bed with the green headboard. This yellow cage bedside light, which is so rad. And this little armchair. But this is what it is like at the Monaco. And then my view outside my window is 
so stunning. I don't know what you'll be able to see, but this right here is like a little nativity. There's these beautiful Christmas trees over in this building that I can see. It's just really, really stunning. My travel accessories were my Keep All 50, I think this is a 55 or a 50. I don't remember. I'm pretty sure it's, I think it's 55. And then I've been using my Louis Vuitton Retiro wallet that has the black edging that I like. And then my Neverfull. This thing is the best. Oh, if you have a traveler in your life, someone who travels a lot, I got these at Anthropology, and I think they are the cutest little travel cases. So, A, this one has, you probably won't be able to see it, but it has like the Wi-Fi symbol on it, and then if you open it up, and I mean, this thing is holding literally everything. It's like a little charger organizer, and then these little furry, beautiful things, a, they have a place to wrap your cords and then little, um, like mesh pockets. They're so cute. And I have been using these for all my camera stuff. So if you have a traveler, that is a great, great gift idea. And throughout Vlogmas, I will try to add little gift ideas like this. Um, and if I can link something, I will link it down below. That was an adventure and a half. I still don't actually know if I'm going the right way. I think I am, but because it is so overcast and rainy, I can't get the GPS to work. None of them. I tried Google Maps. I tried the GPS within the car. I tried Waze from my cell phone, and I could not get any of them to work. So I'm on 279 North. I think, I know North is the right direction. So literally just going to see how this plays out because I have no idea what I'm doing right now. I know if I head towards Erie or Buffalo, I'm all set. I just haven't seen a sign for any of those things, but I do know I'm going North. I could really use a Star of Bethlehem to help me figure this out because I am not a wise man and I cannot figure out what I'm doing. And now the GPS literally just keeps rerouting me. And yeah. All right, I'll keep you posted. I found my way out. I am on the right road. And I am about 15 miles from the Grove City Outlets, and I've never been, but I've heard awesome things about it. And I thought, Vlogmas Day 1, why not swing by the Grove City Outlets, even though it's raining and disgusting, and see what they're all about, and see if maybe we can find a few gifts for people, or just some really neat things around the house. So while I'm driving, I thought I'd give you like a little taste if you haven't seen the Vlogmas intro video that I posted, I think the day before Thanksgiving. Sudden days are just gonna be simple Sundays because it's just about getting the vlog in and getting ready for the work week. Clearly this simple Sunday, I'm driving into a snowstorm, so there's nothing really that simple about it. Um, Mondays are gonna be motivational Mondays. And uh, the reason I chose that is because we're going to focus on a couple different things. So one is going to be like motivation to organize, um, motivation uh, around health and wellness, like different aspects that we sometimes lack motivation with this time of year. I think for health and wellness, we always wait until January, but why would we wait? Um, so that's what you can expect a little bit on Mondays. Tuesdays are going to be Try It Tuesdays, where I do some sort of holiday DIY. We see how it goes. For better or for worse, I'm gonna show how it ends up. So some of them might be really great. I have them all planned out, and some of them might be full-blown disasters, and we'll make it work. On Wednesdays, we're gonna do Wrap It Up Wednesdays, which means I'm gonna show you a different way to wrap a gift and some tips and tricks around wrapping gifts. Thursdays are thankful Thursdays. They're gonna be all around gratitude. A lot of sharing your stories around what you are grateful for, 
um, gratitude that is coming from the advent calendar which has started today once again and I'm so excited it's being shared all over the place it's kind of amazing um, and then Fridays are gonna be fun Fridays that's gonna be something fun happening whether it's we go and look at Christmas lights one night or we go into a little town that's maybe having a festival or something like that um, Saturdays are gonna be scrumptious Saturdays where I'm going to do savory and sweet treats and recipes and ideas for your holiday parties and then once again that takes us back to simple Sunday um, the reason I wanted to do this is because I wanted to make sure I touched on a bunch of different things so that throughout Vlogmas there's something for everyone and I'm excited about that. On Try It Tuesdays there are going to be some new planners we're going to try. I don't know why I did air quotes. <laughs> Wasn't deserving of it. Um, but we are going to actually try out some new planners and look at what's out there for 2020. Um, but I'm super pumped and I think it's gonna be a great vlog mess and yeah I am just so honored and humbled that like you're going to spend your holiday season with me and that we can somehow together and collectively spread kindness through the advent calendar if you've not downloaded yours it's a link down below and uh, just share I think really what this season is all about the season has to be about treating other people kindly and just spreading joy. And I also think one part of the season that gets lost for so many of you, especially all you moms who try to do it all this time of year, is that you will only be great and be able to treat others kindly when you treat yourself kindly. So you will see on the advent calendar there are days planned for just you to take care of you. And I think sometimes we get a little guilt around that, but actually it's a necessity. So uh, make sure that you're always finding time for yourself. All right, so we are going to get to these Grove City outlets. Their Christmas signs are so cute. I have not been in a Kirkland's in forever, and their stuff is so cute. All their Christmas signs, like look at that one. You know I love a bookstore. Oh my goodness. So I didn't film a whole lot while I was in there because I ended up buying things for Steven. Um, it's cold, it's rainy. Next is get gas and get the rest of the way home and just take our time through the storm. But I am wet, I am cold, and all the things. Highly recommend watching the Casey Musgrave special on um, Amazon Prime and downloading the album. It's so good. And if you need some other Christmas music, I've made a Spotify playlist that's also linked down below. You should definitely go check it out, enjoy it, and uh, listen and share in some of the jams that I will be um, listening to all season long. All right, gas station, there is a McDonald's. And if you know me, you know what I'm thinking. Fountain Diet Coke. According to the map 28 minutes from my house which feels about right however i think that 28 minutes is going to take at least an hour because i can see ahead of me and traffic is at a standstill i feel so incredibly blessed that i have made it this far this safely because there have been more accidents and cars and median strips than i've ever seen in my entire life um cars literally have sheets of ice on them but somehow I have had zero problems and I feel so incredibly blessed, but I cannot stop thinking about all the people who have had bad luck traveling. So I'm just hoping anyone who's traveling today is being safe and taking their time. And uh, yes, it's definitely been a ride. 
Um, I've been passing the time by listening to um, a really great podcast, and it's called Dolly Parton's America. She was such a fascinating individual. Um, every episode deals with something different. So uh, I think the one was about like her sad music in the 60s. The next was her phase with Porter Wagner. And this third episode is about her life in the Tennessee mountains growing up and then the creation of Dollywood and all of that. Um, and there are multiple other episodes. But I'm really, really enjoying it. If you have any interest in Dolly Parton or just want a really interesting um, character study, um, I highly suggest the podcast. I made it home. How are you feeling? How are you feeling? I was using an old man who don't feel good. Hi. I miss you. I thought I would show you. My parents bought me this wine advent calendar, which I'm super excited about. And we are going to go ahead and open day number one. Oh my goodness, and it's a bottle of Chardonnay. Like, this is too cute. I'm super excited about this. That's actually a really good size bottle. I probably get two glasses out of that. So, Chardonnay. Um, and while we're at it, let's go ahead. These are Christmas gifts that have arrived for people. And let's go ahead and open these advent calendars here. So this is the one from the body shop. And day number one. Well, I can't find day number one. Oh, day number one, right here. I don't think. So this is a Rose Dewy Glow Face Mist. I love how they have like strong like female characters and then this boy in a tutu. So like gender norms um, are being broken. Santa Claus is a female. I just, I'm here for all of that. Then this is the Sugarfina one. This one is so beautiful this year. Like, look how cute that is. And then these, you don't have to hunt because they're always in order. And this is the Mary Berries. They're juicy gummies flavored with sweet raspberry. And they look like little raspberries. Let's go ahead and pull Paper Chase Stationery out. Number one, number one, number one, number one. Oh, it's right here. Oh, oh, that's really nice. It's a little notebook, but this is like a hard, like plastic cover. It's not like cheap paper. I love how it has the grooves cut out for the band. It has a date page. That's really cute. Also, some of these could work as like little gift toppers for other people if it's something I might not use right away. Let's go ahead and open day one of our nativity scene. Oh my. It's the stable. I have to see how we put that together. So these slide down like so, like so, and then this is the roof piece. I'm just going to say this is by far the most beautiful advent calendar they've done. Uh, this is my fourth year of having this advent calendar um, and I hands down would say it's the most beautiful. Box number one 
is a fragrance. And I will butcher all of these names during Vlogmas, but it's Le Ombre Dons Lu. Mmm, it's citrusy and a little bit of floral. Mmm, I like it. It smells very clean and fresh. Oh, I really do like that. All right, these come in such handy. I usually take these when I travel, um, so I love getting a bunch of these. All right, those are all set. Also, I forgot last year's song to go with the Sugar Fina when I sing Pour Some Sugar On Me. I'll remember for tomorrow. All right, there are my goodies. And yeah, I'm just going to, I'm kind of in the midst of getting unpacked and settled. So look at this Olaf mug. My mom bought me this when we were at the Disney store and I just think it's so cute. All right, going to get settled, get some laundry done. I beat some of the storm. Steven drove by the P.O. box while I was gone and picked up the first two Christmas cards. You should know, every Christmas card you send, I read them, and then I also set up a whole display in the entryway, which I'm going to do it a little bit differently this year. Um, but, oh, I love getting Christmas cards. Aww. Um, and Wendy and Brandon also sent to Stephen and Bubba's with a cat on it. Um, I will read these in a little bit, but these are, <laughs> this one's funny. Don, we now are ugly sweaters. I look forward, and it's such a special moment, um, reading cards from all of you. Um, and I just love displaying them and seeing them all up. I am in proper Vlogmas uniform. I got this Pottery Barn robe. I got some Christmas pajamas, and then some amazing snowman slippers. Um, yeah, I'm just gonna get settled in. I might actually start editing Vlogmas day one. And just so you know, a lot of you have been asking, what book am I going to be reading. I'm actually starting one today, so if you want to join me, you can get it, get it on a Kindle, order it. Um, it's super reasonable, but I've already talked about it. But tonight I'm starting A Christmas Party by Georgette Heyer, um, and it's a seasonal murder mystery. So really looking forward to it. It's gotten great reviews. I'm excited to read it. All right, going to settle in and relax a little bit, enjoy the tree, the decorations, and just chill for a moment. I just edited um, the first round of footage of Vlogmas Day 1 and somehow it's 20 minutes long already, um, which was shocking. Also, if you get concerned because sometimes both of my hands weren't on the steering wheel, literally was going 21 miles per hour and I had autopilot on in my car, so it was steering within the lanes itself. I mean, I was going at a snail's pace um, and the car like stops itself, so I was perfectly safe. Um, I'm just going around right now and turning on all my garlands. So many of you are asking about the fairy lights that I use, so I will leave them linked down below so that you can use them as well. But what's great is they all come with their own remote, but the same remote will work for all of them. And I'm just watching the Casey Musgraves special again because I just, I love her. So turning on the garlands and all of that jazz and just enjoying the fact that I got home safely. Also, some of you have decided to share things uh, from day one of the advent calendar. So remember, if you share and tag me and Follow me over on Instagram. I'm gonna to try to include as many as I can in each day of Vlogmas. So here's some of the ones that have taken place so far. This advent calendar was sent from a dear friend of mine. I can never say it right, Lakatan. I will never say it right. So why even try? But this is a 24 day um, advent calendar and I can't find number one. What's really sweet is she had sent me some products 
and then randomly, th- this was a while ago, and then randomly asked me, she's like, how did you like those products? I was like, I really, really enjoyed them. So then she surprised me with this. 17, 21, 15, 4. 14, 8, 5, 20, 12, 13, 2, 10, Six, oh, there it is. Oh, this will be a fun one because it's hard to see. And the product that came in this one, which I love getting this size product, so it's so nice to travel with, is the Precious Cream. Awesome. Someone else has to open up their advent calendar. And that someone is a Mr. Bubba's. So we have to go get his advent calendar. I ended up getting him a different one. This one is from Williams Sonoma and it is a lot fancier than his one last year. Come here. Come here, we're gonna go sit on the floor and open your advent calendar. So this one's fancy, it's magnetic and it's so well made. Looky, this is day number one. This is day number one. Aw, oh wait, wait, before you eat it, look how cute these are. It says joy. Hey, looky, looky. Hey, looky. <gasps> are you joyful? He's slowing down. If you guys remember last year how crazed he would get, he's just, just slowing down a bit. Is that a good cookie? Oh. <laughs> you probably can't tell, but he's making quite a mess. Bubba's has had his advent calendar, and I think this is a perfect ending of Vlogmas Day 1. I'm going to end it like I end all of them. Take care of yourself, take care of others, and be kind. Kindness is free. Give it to everyone. Until next time, bye-bye.